Until now, Republicans have been guarded in their criticism of fellow Republican Jeff Cruz. But this afternoon, Senator Tim Canope said he believes the women who accused Cruz of inappropriate touching and hugging at the state capitol, and he issued a statement that read, I respectfully call on Senator Cruz to retire or resign from the Oregon Senate. Well, we just want to give you a chance to respond to the no sexual comment, harassment please. report. I tried to ask no Senator comment. Cruz about those accusations well, today. You've been very talkative in the past, and we've always appreciated your openness. Yeah. We are still going through a formal process, and we're going to let the process play out. That's but several it. women have said that you made them uncomfortable, you continued to harass them? Uh, no comment. We're going through a formal process. We will let the process play out. The governor and others have asked that you step down. No will comment. you be doing that? Please. No comment, please. Do you feel that you can represent your constituents? It's a lovely day for a walk. I'm wondering maybe you could even just talk about the apology that you issued to the two senators? Please, leave us alone. Well, it's a public sidewalk. He's an elected representative. I think it'd be easier if he just answered our questions. We've got all day. And we would love to hear what you have to say, Senator. Okay, 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 take it easy. Yesterday, Governor Kate Brown called on Cruz to resign, writing, Senator Cruz's behavior is not acceptable in the Capitol or any workplace, and he should step down. Of course, this is all a blow to Southern Oregon. Senator Cruz represents Roseburg. He'd already been stripped of all his committee assignments by the Senate president, and now he's literally left the building. It's hard enough for them to get their issues and voices heard up here. This would no doubt make it all that much harder.